All right, guys, it is Saturday night again, and I am so excited, as usual, about the movie that we are going to watch tonight. Before we talk about that, though, I need to tell you guys that the Halloween season is just about to begin. July 29th is the grand opening of the Spirit Halloween Store, the flagship store in New Jersey, and I am going to be there. Now, the next three months after that are super busy for me because I'm everywhere filming all kinds of awesome Halloween stuff. Now, with that in mind, that takes away a lot of my time, and I will not be able to keep brand new, fresh episodes of Saturday Night Snack and a Movie coming. I will try when I can squeeze them in, but on Saturday nights when I don't have a fresh new one, I will at the very least be sharing some of my favorite Halloween Saturday Night Snack and a Movie episodes from the past. And I've been doing this for what, like four years now? So we have some pretty good ones. Now also with Halloween in mind, give me just a second here. That is much better. We needed a little bit more Halloweeniness in the home theater here. As you can see, I left up Mr. Beetlejuice, but we have added an awesome golden skull candy bowl and some candy corn and pumpkin pillows, which I'm going to show you in just a minute where I got them for dirt cheap. But first, let's talk about the movie for tonight. Tonight's movie is Monster House. Now, if you have not seen the Monster House, totally awesome. Back in the day, it was a brand new form of animation, so it's kind of strange, but it's a totally awesome movie. You're going to love it if you haven't seen it. And it is the perfect movie to kick off the 2023 spooky Halloween season. If you have seen it, you're going to understand tonight's snacks a lot better, because we are having never crackers, skulls, chocolate milk, and awesome kite pizzas. <laughs> come with me while we go to the Dollar Tree, get everything we need, and then we'll come back here and we're going to get it all ready and have an awesome spooky Halloween movie night with Monster House. But first, who's ready to monster? <laughs> All right, guys, we are heading into the Dollar Tree because the Dollar Tree always comes through. Holy crap, right off the bat, Halloween pumpkin pillows and candy corn pillows. I'll take those, I'll take this, and I'll take this. Thank you. All right, let's not get sidetracked because what we are in here to find is never crackers and stuff to make awesome Kites. Okay, now, here's just some little bags of crackers. I don't think that's what we want. I want, like, I don't know, some kind of crackers that we can put a spray cheese on. That's kind of weird to call it spray cheese, but I think you know what I mean. Just that cheese that comes in a can and you, like, squirt it onto your crackers. I really don't know if we're going to find any of that in here, but I think we can at least get the crackers. And uh, if we have to go to a different grocery store or like Walmart or something, I, did I just call it Walmart? Walmart or something to get that cheese, then we will do so. So here are crackers, and it looks like we have a pretty good selection here. Here's, oh my gosh, they're called thin wheats here instead of wheat thins. But those are pretty dang tasty. We have the regular ones here that are just kind of like Ritz crackers. Those are always good. Oh, now these I really like. Chicken flavored baked snack crackers. I think that's what I'm going to get. But really anything could be never crackers, whatever your crackers are that you like. Here's animal crackers. And then here's chocolate animal crackers. Oh my gosh, that gives me an even better idea, guys. What I'm going to do is whether you got this kind or the kind that I'm getting right here, these chicken ones, or even anything else. 
I'm gonna make a cover for this box that says Neber Crackers and has Neber Cracker on it. Wait, look at this. They have Bang here at the $1.25 tree. I've never heard of this kind. Swirly Pop. I have had the Swirly Pop Pop from Cracker Barrel and it was pretty disgusting. Crazy Key Lime Pie. I would have to guess that these are gross and that's probably why they're here for a buck twenty-five. And yeah, I don't see any of that uh, cheese in a can stuff. A lot of people think that's gross. I think it's pretty dang good. Oh my gosh, guys, look at what we got right here. Oh no, it's a bottle. You know what, instead of getting these chicken flavored crackers and having to go to another store to get that cheese stuff, I think I'm just gonna get a box of these Lance Captain wafers, cream cheese and chives. And we'll do the same thing, we'll just make a new cover for it. So Never Cracker is actually on there as the brand. Okay, the other thing that I need to find is the stuff to make Bones Awesome Kite. And what my idea was, was to make awesome kite pizzas because they usually have like those pizza crusts here, but I am not seeing them anywhere. I absolutely hate when I get an idea in mind and then I cannot find what I need to execute that idea. Every time I'm in this store, they have those things and this one time that I want them, they don't have them. I mean, I suppose we could get like the deep dish pizza here, the little red barons, and just cut them in the shape of a kite. That's what I was gonna do with the other uh, crust anyway. Or here's Tony's, they have cheese, pepperoni, supreme, and meat trio. Okay, they do have Skull's chocolate milk. You make me want to throw up in some tinfoil and eat it. DJ, you pee in bottles? All right, in the name of not having to go to another store, I'm gonna go ahead and get a Tony's pizza to do this with, and I think I'll go for the Supreme. I just cannot believe they don't have those things. I've been up and down these aisles 20 times looking, and if they had them, they would most likely be in this aisle right here because here's like the spaghetti sauce and uh, stuff like that, um, pasta, here's some wraps. I mean, you could use something like this if you wanted to, but I don't want to. But the Tony's pizza will work. At least that'll cut out some of the work for us. We don't have to actually put together a pizza on our own, as if it's that hard. Here's Jenny's licorice whips. Z's peanut clusters. What in the world? How did I miss these? Look at this, guys. They are skull snack bowls. We have a bluish multicolored one, silver, gold, and black. What the heck? I am definitely buying the gold one. That is the coolest thing ever. They are just starting to put out the Halloween stuff here at the Dollar Tree, so I will be back to make a full video and it will be on the Nate Guy on Halloween channel, so keep an eye out. But look at this stuff, guys. Oh my gosh, never mind. I'm not even going to show you because it's so cool and you'll just have to wait. All right, I think we're done in here. I'm going to start spending money on stuff that I shouldn't if I don't to get out of here soon. Such as, hello, squishy ball. It's called a Guzuka squeezer. What the heck? Okay, guys, so we have our chocolate milk. There's nothing that we need to do with that. In a minute, we're gonna go downstairs and we're gonna make our very own box of Never Crackers. But first, we need to get this Tony's Pizza in the oven and cooking. And after we make our crackers, we'll come up and we will cut this into the shape of an awesome kite. Wow, it's been a long time since I've had a Tony's Pizza. Look at that thing. I I'm actually beginning to think this might taste kind of good. <laughs> So that's just about ready to go into the oven. I kind of took a knife and I scraped it, all the toppings like over in the shape that we're gonna be cutting out in the shape of a kite because I didn't want to lose those toppings and we're just gonna be cutting the edges off. All right, we'll stick this in the oven, head downstairs and make our Never Crackers. So to create our Never Crackers, we're gonna take this box of crackers and you can see how there's kind of a design on there that says it's crackers. You can see the Lance logo on there. We're just going to pull some pictures from the internet and create our own cracker box with the logo of Never 
crackers. <laughs> so if we just do a quick Google search for Nebercracker, you can see that there's a whole bunch of pictures of him that come up. And all we have to basically do is pick out one that we think would look good on the front of the box. I actually kind of like this one right here. And the same thing with crackers. If we just do a Google search for crackers, we get all kinds of pictures of crackers. Now, I kind of like this one down here, but... Um, actually, this one over here. I like that one much better. That looks more like what's in the actual box. It's a little bit different from what's on here, but we're just creating our own box, so we can really look any way we want it to. Now, the next place we're going to go is this website up here called Cool Text Graphics Generator. It has all these different kinds of fonts and colors, and you can create whatever you want it to say. We're going to choose this one right here called Keen. Then I simply typed in the word Never, because that's going to be our brand, and it shows you what it's going to look like right there. And if you go over and click on Logo, it'll take you down here where you can change the colors of that. I just want it to be white. So there it is, Never in white. Then we're going to go down here and hit Create Logo. It creates the logo and brings it up here. You right click on it and go down to save image as, and it will save it to your computer. So I went through that same process with the word crackers, only I made crackers kind of a yellow orange. Then I went into just my basic paint program on the computer and here is our new box cover, Neber Crackers. We got our picture of Neber over here. We got our crackers, Neber and crackers, and that will go on the front of our box. So when you're printing, you have to play around with the size a little bit. You can see this one's a little smaller, this one's a little bit bigger. We want it the right size to fit right over that. So it's gonna be this one right here. And as you can see, if we just set it over top, it's gonna fit on there perfectly. And it's not perfect, but there we go. Our very own box of Never Crackers. Okay, that was quick. Let's, hmm. Okay, hello, pizza. <laughs> Maybe I should have shaved off about four minutes from that cooking time. All right, we're gonna get our halloween -y orange plate ready and our cutting board. And I believe, yes, we have a pizza cutter. Let's carefully carry this over to our cutting board. And I don't have my tripod up here, so give me a minute while I cut this in the shape of a kite. All right, there we go. Looks like a kite to me. <laughs> Let's go ahead and put that on our plate over here. And there we go. Awesome kite pizza. And of course we have all this extra stuff over here which we are not gonna let go to waste. We are also gonna chomp on that. In fact, after I take my picture, I'm just gonna take all that and throw it on this plate too. But for now, there we have it guys. We have Skulls Chocolate Milk. I should have made a label for that with Skull on it. We have our very own box of Never Crackers. And we have Bones Awesome Kite Pizza. All right, guys, that is it for this episode. I'm going to kick back here with my awesome Halloweeniness pillows, my chocolate milk, my Never Crackers, and my awesome kite pizza. And I am going to watch Monster House.